absolutely delighted to be one of the new partners for uh, Plymouth Argyle. I mean, we're both big Plymouth uh, community resources, and uh, of course, you know, Argyle is embedded right in the middle of Plymouth and has huge community reach. And um, it's something that you know I'm really looking forward to sharing with them. Well, we'll be flying the flag for Argyle. Um, many of our people are uh, part of the Green Army, and uh, of course. Um, we're looking forward to going down to the grounds and spreading the word about the community stuff that we do as well. So I think there's plenty of scope for mutual benefit. And also we're here as a resource for our car. You know, people, um, players and stuff want to come up and have a break with their families. They may be a long way from home perhaps. Um, we're, we're just really happy to be part of it. On a personal note, it's, it's probably been a uh, dream, a lifetime dream. I'm a, I'm a massive Argyle fan. Um, support the club as a child, so to work with our own town football club is probably something you can always dream of. Um, as for charity, I mean it's phenomenal. Well obviously for us the charity is a family, we, we, we support each other and Argyle are a family, a club, you know you can feel that, the warmth and the club do so much fantastic work in the community and us working together can only benefit because what we, we both believe in the same thing. I think it's great, you know, to two local charities who care. You know, we both care about all these different spectrums, ours is men's health and animals and the public. Working together can only be great. And we want to work on some great stuff and look forward to it. Well, I think this is one of the really important things that things like football clubs and, and local community resources can do is spread awareness about important uh, health issues that affect people. I was a um, contributing editor at Men's Health magazine um, a long time ago and I'm very aware of male cancer um, and the fact that men don't do enough self-checks and for instance very few people know that men get breast cancer. Um, most men don't and they'll get a lump and they'll just won't think anything of it. Women are sort of clued into this and they'll, any kind of any cha changes they'll take to the doctor whereas men don't and often leave it too late. So helping to spread awareness about things like that is I think really important.